Go ahead. Uh, today is Tuesday, um, uh, April the 27th, and this is Order of Conklin. While we quiet our hearts, O oh, Almighty God, who pourest out on all who desire it, the spirit of grace and of supplication, deliver us when we draw near to thee from coldness of heart and wanderings of mind, that with steadfast thoughts and kindled affections, we may worship thee in spirit and in truth through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Amen. The Lord Almighty grant us a peaceful night and a perfect end. Amen. Our help is in the name of the Lord, the maker of heaven and earth. Let us confess our sins to God. Almighty God, our heavenly Father, we have sinned against you through our own fault in thought, in word, and deed, and in what we have left undone. For the sake of your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, forgive us all our offenses and grant that we may serve you in newness of life to the glory of your name. Amen. May the Almighty God grant us forgiveness of all our sins and the grace and comfort of the Holy Spirit. Amen. O God, make speed to save us. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be. Amen. Alleluia. Turn to page 619 and we will pray together Psalm 28. O Lord, I call to you, my rock. Do not be deaf to my cry, lest if you do not hear me, I become like those who go down to the pit. Hear the voice of my prayer when I cry out to you, when I lift up my hands to your holy of holies. Do not snatch me away with the wicked or with the evildoers who speak peaceably with their neighbors while strife is in their hearts. Repay them according to their deeds and according to the wickedness of their actions. According to the work of their hands, repay them and give them their just deserts. They do not they have no understanding of the Lord's doings, nor of the works of his hands. Therefore, he will break them down and not build them up. Blessed is the Lord, for he has heard the voice of my prayer. The Lord is my strength and my shield. My heart trusts in him, and I have been helped. Therefore, my heart dances for joy. And in my song, will I praise him. The Lord is the strength of his people, a safe refuge for his anointed. Save your people and bless your inheritance. Shepherd them and carry them forever. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be. Amen. Come unto me, all who labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me, for I am gentle and lowly in heart, and you will find rest for your souls. For my yoke is easy and my burden is light. Thanks be to God. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. For you have redeemed me, O Lord, O God of truth. 
Keep us, O Lord, as the apple of your eye and hide us under the shadow of your wings. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Lord, hear our prayer and let our cry come unto thee. Let us pray. Look down, O Lord, from your heavenly throne and illume this night with your celestial brightness that by night as by day, your people may glorify your holy name through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Together, let us pray in the middle of page 134. Keep watch, dear Lord, with those who work or watch or weep this night and give your angels charge over those who sleep. Tend the sick, Lord Christ, give rest to the weary, bless the dying, soothe the suffering, pity the afflicted, shield the joyous, and all for your love's sake. Amen. You may now unmute yourselves and offer any prayers and thanksgivings that are on your heart. Thank you for this meeting today, Lord, and all of the friends who are having. Jennifer, for Kip. Carol, thanks for David's placement. Carol and Lindsay. We give Excuse thanks me. for the birth of Mary B. Yes. Amen. Yeah, amen. For the Tabor family who lost their home to fire today. Oh, my goodness. Healing for Marty Dodd, who's dealing with COVID. Patrick, Art, Bill, my brother-in-law, Dave, who will have a cochlear implant on uh, Thursday. Marilyn, my sister, Kathy, Doris, Steve, Debbie. We offer these prayers, O oh Lord, to your holy name. Amen. Amen. Guide us waking, O oh Lord. And guard us sleeping, sleeping. that awake, awake we may we watch, may watch with Christ, Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Lord, you have now set your servant free to go in peace as you have promised. For these eyes of mine have seen the Savior, whom you have prepared for all the world to see, a light to enlighten the nations and the glory of your people, Israel. Glory to the Father yeah. and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be. Amen. Guide us waking, O Lord, and guard us sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ and asleep we may rest in peace. Alleluia, alleluia, Alleluia. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks, Thanks be, be to God. O oh Lord, support us all the day long until the shadows lengthen and the evening comes and the busy world is hushed and the fever of life is over and our work is done. Then in thy mercy, grant us a safe lodging and a holy rest and peace at the last. Amen. The Almighty and merciful Lord, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, bless us and keep us. Amen.